Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and, today Microsoft released, a new insider preview build to the Dev and Beta channel. After updating to this build, the build version will be changed to 22598. Starting with this build, Microsoft is providing Windows 11 ISO, of the same build, from which you can do a clean Windows 11 installation. Like last week, this build includes only a handful of changes and improvements, but includes a good set of fixes, that will improve insiders' overall experience on their device. Microsoft is now offering new builds to Windows Insiders in China on Lenovo PCs, starting with build 22598. Also, Microsoft is trying out auto-launch the Get Started app with some Windows Insiders after upgrade to help people get started with their PC. As this build is for both beta and dev channels, so, if you wish you can still switch between channels. Moreover, Microsoft is trying out Windows Spotlight on a desktop is on by as the default background for new devices. Here new devices mean, the devices on which a clean installation has been performed, using this build ISO. And for upgrades where the background the Windows 11 default. Microsoft is trying this experience out with a limited number of Windows insiders at first. So it's likely possible, that you may not receive this feature. Besides this, Microsoft is also trying out displaying 4K desktop backgrounds in Windows Spotlight. And this will be also for a limited number of users. And lastly, today Microsoft is starting to roll out a new update to Media Player for Windows 11, version 11.2203.30.0 to Windows Insiders in the dev channel. You can now switch between two different views on the artist page when browsing your collection. One view shows you all the albums in a grid, the other shows all the songs, grouped by album. We've also added quick actions to albums, artists, videos, and playlists when you hover over them for quick selection and playback. There's also now a handy context menu available if you right-click on the now playing screen. From here you can open new files without navigating to another page. You can also quickly access the album page and the artist page for your current song. Microsoft has added a new video enhancements feature as well, which allows you to adjust the brightness and contrast of your video. So, that was all the new things, changes, and improvements and features introduced in this build. This build also has some fixes, to know more about it, head to the link given in the description. Hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below, thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.